Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's Mila B and today I'm trying out a new odorless monomer that I picked up from Etsy. I will leave the link in the description box. I'm also trying out this lime neon color acrylic that I got from iGel Beauty. So our first look is exactly just as bright as I want it to be. So let's talk about this monomer. This monomer did have an odor, but it was very, 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 very light. Like it really could have been no odor but it was like just a hint but as everyone knows if you watch my channel I, I only use no odor monomer now my favorite has been the nail supply glamour because it's truly no odor and it's not too difficult to work with but if i'm gonna compare apples to apples the nail supply glamour one is really good for people who are new to nails and very slow because it's very slow setting versus this one it's not as fast as traditional monomer, but it's much quicker than the nail supply glamour. So just depending on what you're doing for my, when I'm working with my dominant hand, I probably would use this one. And when I work with my non-dominant, I would probably use the nail supply glamour. So it really just depends on how comfortable you are with acrylic. But as you can see, like it does a really good job of picking up the acrylic. The issue with this video or with this set that I did was actually the acrylic, not the monomer. And I know this because I ended up trying it with other acrylics and I had a much better result. This acrylic was a beautiful color, however, it marbled a lot. So you'll see me kind of do like an ombre look later. I come in and the reason why I did that is because I couldn't get that true all the way through color, no matter how much I added, because it just marbled a lot. When I got to this next nail, I know you guys can see that. That is my cuticle. I had pushed them all the way back. I filed my nails, drilled my nails, everything. And that piece was still there and I couldn't find my nippers to pull it off. So I ended up coming in with some actual <laughs> shears, hair shears, and cutting that skin off at the end of the video because it was really irking me, but at least I won't have any lifting because it isn't on my nail bed. So I got around to trying out this monomer with some acrylic from Nail Supply Glamour and I will say I definitely liked it way better. I experienced no marbling so at this point I knew that it had to have been the acrylic. Um, even off camera I tried it with some more acrylics. I think it was just this particular color just it just is what it is. It, it marbled or it, it just that's what it did. But I went ahead and ombre these nails, just trying to give it a little different look and 
see how everything went and then when i was done off camera i encapsulate all these nails now the other thing i really liked about this monomer it does not take forever to dry like a lot of no odor monomers so overall this was a really good investment i really like these nails so let me know what you guys think in the comment section make sure that you subscribe and i'll see you guys on my next video mila b out